Tony Kushner has come out in support of Jonathan Glazer's controversial Oscars acceptance speech. The celebrated playwright and screenwriter, a four-time Academy Award nominee, made a recent podcast appearance and was asked about his feelings on a number of topics related to the Israel-Gaza conflict in addition to Glazer's speech. In his acceptance speech, Glazer shared that he made the zone of interest in an effort to show, quote, where dehumanization leads at its worst and how it shapes the past and present. Right now, we stand here as men who refute their Jewishness and the Holocaust being hijacked by an occupation which has led to conflict for so many innocent people. He added, whether the victims of October 7th in Israel or the ongoing attack on Gaza, all the victims of this dehumanization, how do we resist? The filmmaker's speech has been attacked by some Jewish figures in Hollywood and was the subject of a recent open letter signed by 1,000 people. Kushner was asked if he agrees with Glazer's comments, to which the playwright says, of course, I mean, who doesn't? Kushner explains, what Glazer's saying is so, is so simple. He's saying Jewishness, Jewish identity, Jewish history, the history of the Holocaust, the history of Jewish suffering must not be used as an excuse for a project of dehumanizing or slaughtering other people. He added, what kind of person thinks that what's going on now in Gaza is acceptable? And if you find yourself saying out loud and in public, oh, it's fine with me what they're doing because you feel that it's the only choice for you because you're a Jew is to defend everything that Israel does, you know, shame on you. Kushner concluded that he wanted Israelis to be able to live in peace and security but added, the treatment of the Palestinians, as many Israelis have been saying for decades, actually doesn't make Israel safe. For more on Tony Kushner's comments, head to THR.com. And for the latest entertainment news and updates, keep watching The Hollywood Reporter News.